Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I'm Jamie B. Thanks for stopping by. So in today's video, I'm going to be doing my BoxyCharm haul unboxing. So I went back to the BoxyCharm website when they had a big sale and I bought a bunch of things. So I wanna open them up and share them with you. So if you're excited to see what I got from BoxyCharm, then go ahead and hit that subscribe button at the bottom of this video and we'll get right into it. All right guys, so I went on there I think it was after I did my add-on for May and I saw like a bunch of things on sale and I was like oh okay I'm gonna grab a few things and then I want a little few thing crazy so I didn't get too much but I will show you what I got so the first thing I got was the cosmetics clean clinical luxurious this is the face massager I believe so the pr I don't have the actual prices to the to these but I will tell you what I paid for them so this is the face massager I'll go ahead and show you this like this and then this is all kinds of stuff that's been in previous boxes that I have not gotten. So it is a forehead, cheek, collarbone, upper arm, hand, neck, shoulder, and um, calves can all be massaged by it. So that's pretty cool. I will be using it for my face. And basically you just gently roll it over your face. Oh, it's nice and cold. Yeah, so your cheeks up and down on the forehead from your chin to your eyes they should be gentle i don't know what this is supposed to do but i got it because i liked it if you guys want to tell me what a massager is used for for your face go ahead and let me know down below i got it because i thought it looked cool <laughs> so the next thing i got was a refill on the avant um eight hour radiance renewal sleeping mask this one i do know is 107 dollars originally and i paid 18 dollars for this one so i actually got this in my boxy charm and used it all and i love it it makes my skin so smooth so that's why i rebought it um and i didn't want to pay 107 dollars for it so i paid 18 on the sale so the next thing i got was the um hourglass ambient lighting blush I wanted to get a darker shade, but this is the only one they had left. And this is originally $40 and I got it for $12. It's called Diffused Heat. So I'll go ahead and show you. It's just a very light, pretty blush. So I think it's gonna be a little light for me, but for what I usually like, but it's not bad. You'll be able to see it. I actually don't have very many hourglass items. So I was excited to get that one at a decent price. And then the last two things in here are gonna be like several things. I got two different bo surprise boxes. I think it was July, yep, July and May of 2019. It's their mystery box and they were each $21. So I don't know how much they usually are. It doesn't tell me that, but I'm gonna go ahead and open them up for you. I don't know. Okay, so this one is July of 2019 and it comes with all the goodies like a regular boxy charm would. We have a coupon. And we have the card to tell us how much everything is. Yay! So the first thing I see is the LMS Superfood Vital Veggie Mask. I actually really love this skincare brand and I have quite a few things from them. So I'm excited to try this one out. And this is $35. And then we have some Luxie brushes. Okay, so here are the brushes it comes with. I'll probably use this one for my skincare mask and then these two will either be for concealer or something. I don't know. They're they're kind of cheap feeling. They're very, very synthetic, um, but they're not bad. And they're cute little wooden handles. And those retail for $30. So I also have cleansing spa water wipes from Ko Jindo, KGD, and these retail for $17. I will not be opening these. I'm gonna put them in my giveaway. I don't use makeup removing wipes. Um, they just don't do well with my skin. And so the next thing I have is a high definition liquid lipstick by Adesi. This is not safe, be safe. That's how I open my shnite. So this retails for $24. Let me open her up. So you could definitely tell it's been sitting there for a while because it's all broken up inside. So I will have to mix it. There's no color on here, so I don't really know what color this is or what it's called, but it's like a chocolatey brown. It's like a chocolatey brown, I would say. It smells good and it's thick. 
This is a high definition liquid lipstick. Okay. It feels more like it's going to be a gloss. So let's see throughout the video how it dries, but it definitely feels like a thick gloss. It's a pretty color. So the last thing I have in here is the Butter London Natural Goddess eyeshadow palette. And I think it's so cute and I love the flowers. And this is a $32 eyeshadow palette. Oh, it's cute. So I'm not gonna use this one because I do think I'm gonna put this one in the giveaway as well. So it has a cover over it and I'm not gonna remove it, but it has some really pretty colors in there. I just know that I won't use them. It looks very similar to the Zoeva one I just got. So I'm gonna put that off to the side to also put in the giveaway. So we're now gonna open May 2019's box. Oh, I'm excited for this one. All right, so this was for May of 2019. And this is the thing I'm most excited about. This is the Glam Glow Gentle Bubble Daily Conditioning Cleanser. Look at that packaging. So freaking cute. All right, and this retails for a whopping $28, which I'm surprised because usually they're really expensive. So there it is, and that's really pretty, and I cannot wait to use, I have so much freaking skincare. It smells good that it's not even funny. So the next thing we have here is a Eye Lustre Cream Eyeshadow from Ciate London, and this retails for $22. I'm not gonna open it because I'm also gonna be putting it in the giveaway. It's just a very shimmery, purpley, yellow cream eyeshadow. Um, that's like a lot of cream eyeshadow in a tube for me, for anybody really, because unless you're using this every day, this is gonna last for like ever. <laughs> So the next thing we have is Steve Laurent, and I've only ever seen him or this brand in BoxyCharm. Like I've never actually seen it in the stores, so I don't know where it's sold, but this is $22 and this is a lip gloss in the shade Posh. Let's see what we got. Ooh, that is a pretty color. Okay, looks almost very similar to the other one. It's almost identical, it could be its sister color. It even smells like it, that's really weird. So this is the Steve Laurent one in the color Posh and I really, really love this color. It's a very pigmented gloss. Um, and also this color still has not dried down at all. So I'm thinking that this one is actually a pigmented lip gloss as well and not a liquid lipstick, not a matte liquid lipstick at least. So we have two more things in here. So the next thing is a vintage by Jessica Labinskin, I don't know, cashmere lip pencil in mocha. And this is $21. Um, I'm not gonna use this, I'll probably put this in the giveaway, just because I don't like these kind of pencil, um, lip liners like they're just not my favorite and then the last thing we have is the alamar colorette blush trio Ooh, this is really pretty packaging Let's see what we got in here and this one retails for 22 dollars <gasps> oh i've seen this one this one is so beautiful so we have seclusion isla and toasted Oh my gosh. I cannot put this in the giveaway because I'm in love. These are like my blush colors right here. All I ever need in my life are these three colors. Oh my gosh. So pretty. I'm just going to swatch them so you guys can see them on my skin. Ooh, oh my god, okay. I absolutely love these. They are not shimmery, which I like. I'm not a big fan of shimmery blushes. The one looks like it toasted, looks like it could have a little shimmer in it, but nothing crazy. But I think this is so cute, and they're decent sizes that you're getting there for $22. I might have to see which other ones they have, because I love me a good blush set. Because I love blush. I'm obsessed with it. So that is it for my BoxyCharm haul. So basically what I did was I know that Boxy has a bunch of 
like sales where previous stuff that they've sold um, is on sale instead of like what you would pay retail for in the store. So I went through and I just bought a bunch of stuff. Um, some of the stuff that I've already used and I love and then some stuff that I wanted to try and for a decent amount too. Like all that stuff I just got in those boxies, they were only $21 which is less than what the actual boxy is monthly so and also i'm finally off the wait list for boxy charms premium so i will be unboxing that for may as soon as they get to me um so but that is it guys i'm really excited i might do another haul from them because it is pretty decent priced makeup that i'm getting for like cheap so let me know if you guys have ever gone shopping on boxy's website or do you just get the box let me know down below and as always guys make sure you give this video a big thumbs up and i will see you on the next one bye